Welcome back to the live launch of Celebrity Big Brother 2012. Even with poor old Natalie dropping a couple of embarrassing clangers, our nine housemates do seem to be getting on famously, don't they? Now, we know our next housemate is a fan of Big Brothers. I'm talking about the programme. It's housemate number 10. Hi, I'm Natasha Giggs. You may know me for the well-publicised affair I had with my brother-in-law, Manchester United footballer Ryan Giggs. It was eight years. I was only 20 when it started. I don't feel like I've really had the chance to put my side across, obviously, other than what people read. I did make a mistake, but I held my hands up. Nobody's really said anything about him, and it's all been about what I've said and what I've done. I can't go and kick a ball around the pitch for 90 minutes and score a goal and all hail hero again. I regret, obviously, all the hurt that I caused that we caused. I mean, I wish, obviously, I hadn't started it to begin with. The public's instant reaction is going to be, oh, my God, what the hell is she doing in there? I'm loud, outspoken, quite feisty, sensitive. I can't eat food that other people make for me, unless it's my mum. I'm really weird like that. <laughs> Definitely not looking for a romance in the house. Definitely not. <laughs> It's Natasha Giggs. Natasha, let's have a little chat before you go in that house. So, um, how does it feel? Just get you, turn this way for me. How does it actually feel uh, getting um, that reception tonight? A mixture of boos and cheers. I expected the boos. I expected the boos, but thank you for the cheers. I like it. You're still smiling. Uh, do you hope by being in the house it will change people's perception of you in the outside world? Um, I just think it's a good way for people to see me in a different light than what I've been portrayed. OK. Uh, what would you miss the most by being in the house for potentially the next three weeks? My children! <laughs> will they be allowed to watch Mummy on telly? Um, they won't watch it, no. My mum will tape it and decide what they can watch. <laughs> Whether you're being good or not. Yeah. <laughs> now, you're no stranger to scandal. Mm, no. Will you be keeping your head down in there or going to cause a bit of drama? Um, I'll be myself, so... Maybe a little yeah, bit of yeah. scandal. <laughs> In you go, it's Natasha Giggs. Enjoy it. Natasha is a mum of two. She says she wouldn't want to be in a house with needy or self-obsessed people. Her ideal housemate would be Liam Gallagher. She <laughs> hates bad manners. Natasha's 29 and a Libran. <laughs> oh my god! I was broken! I'm fine, thank you. Hello, I'm nice Natasha. You. Hello, I'm Natasha. Nice to meet you too. Hello, I'm Natasha. Really great. Oh. Lovely to meet you. Oh, <laughs> Hi! I just did it for you. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. Thank you. How are you doing? Yes, I'm How was that out there? Uh, it wasn't actually as bad as I thought it would be. Hello, I'm Gabba. Hi, I'm the Hello, Charlie. Hello, Charlie. Nice to meet you. Nice Yes, thank you. Good, good. Hi, Georgia. Hello, hello. Okay. Hi, thank you. Lovely to meet you. Hi, you look great. Hi. What's your name? Natasha. Natasha, nice to meet you. Hi, I'm Gabba. Good evening. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I love your shoes. Nicola. I would love one, please. I thought everybody would be absolutely sloshed yeah. already. No, they wouldn't give us any, would they? Oh, I mean, yeah. oh, I Look at Nicola and Natasha. Ooh. 
So that's a total of 10 celebs living together. Now it seems we have a number of lovely ladies in the house, but I do wonder if any of them are looking for their perfect man. And you never know, he could even be our next entry. It's housemate number 11. <laughs> Yo, what's good, people? This is Romeo. People say I'm most famous for, I would say, being in Soul Solid Crew. Um, had a number one back in 2001 with 21 seconds. Yo, I got 21 seconds before I got to go. I got 21 seconds and my vocals done. Two multiplied by 10 plus one. Romeo done. I got 21 seconds. Mobile Wars, Brit Awards, Enemies, you name it. We collected all of them and just ran, you know? As a solo artist, I had a few top 10 hits as well. One featuring Christina Millian, Sue Gravy, um, and a song called Romeo Dunn as well. We basically done everything and everything. You name it, we did it, and I think it was just a ball. Well, the type of person that I'm portraying is a person from 10th floor council flat estate, you know, Battersea, Southwest 11 Junction, born, born and bred in a two bedroom flat with a single mother. Going into Big Brother, I think the main thing is being worried about the tasks, because you don't know what Big Brother's gonna throw at you. A lot of people have, have hit breaking points in, in Big Brother, so I might have mine, you never know. I might crack. <laughs> I think I'm ready for the challenge. Yeah, let's go. Let's do this. It's Romeo. so cool and I must admit the ladies screaming a lot when you walked out now you're famous for being in a crew and you're about to join another yeah what sort of housemates are you looking forward to spending time with in there um just everyone getting up getting to know real people you know just genuine down-to-earth celebrities and yeah take it from there man just come to enjoy myself and have some fun and yeah, get to know some more people. Um, are you going to be the leader of the crew inside that house, Romeo? Um, I'm not a follower, put it that way, so I'm just going to do me, be me. Simple. Now, um, will you be looking for any lovely ladies to get cozy with in there, Romeo? Anyone in particular? Mm, I'm good, I'm seeing how it goes, you know? If there's someone nice in there, there's someone nice in there, but I'm cool, I'm blessed. You are cool and you're keeping your options open. You're like ice, you're yeah. making me shiver. <laughs> Give us a hug. It's Romeo! Get in there! Ah. Romeo's real name is Marvin Dawkins. Romeo's a night owl and usually stays up until 3 a.m. His suitcase is so full, he had to stand on it to get it closed. He's 31 and a Scorpio. What's up, my brother? Yeah. Romeo, <laughs> <laughs> you're good. Oh, that was nice. Can I change that? How you doing, man? Good to see you, man. Good to see you. Nice to meet you, Andrew. How you doing, Frankie? Frankie, yeah. Yeah, X-Factor, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. You're right? Hey, man, Gareth. How you doing, Gareth? You're going to be the better to meet you, brother. Nice one, man. Wow. Hi, I'm Lisa. How you doing, darling? Pleasure to meet you. Pleasure. Hello. Hello. Natalie. Oh, I nearly mm -hmm. jumped over. That would have been quite on your back. <laughs> 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 Did you? I mean, it's just been really boring. Oh, I can't help it. Can you tell me what's your name, darling? Natasha. I think you're nothing bad. Right. Oh. Um, <laughs> you're the man. <laughs> you're the man. I'm a big fan of us. Three months, man, three months in here. 
So he's getting you a drink. Come on. Oh. <laughs> yeah, 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 definitely. Yeah. <laughs> My mouth's all dry and everything. Yeah. <laughs> See, everyone's the same. <laughs> um, I was, all, you know, I was all right. I was cool, but as soon as I got to the door, I thought, wow, I'm going in the house. Natalie, yeah, this is saying. Big Brother. Go over to Christina and Carissa and talk to them with an American accent. So, I know I'm interrupting, but you have to help me with my American accent. Oh, I will. Because I'm not very good, so I thought if you help me, then no, maybe. No, you can help us. Help us. Is that good? And I can teach you. We've been learning some words. I have to do that, which is. No, I, I want to learn the accent. Oh, my God. If you, if you think yeah. Anything. American. And she'd go where? <laughs> New York. She can do it. LA. She can do it. I think you're born with it. South Africa. And do you know, well, you're right because you know my nephew can do the same. Sorry, my niece can do exactly the same. No. She can do exactly. She's only 10. Really good at impersonation. Really good. Like, yeah. I'd yeah. love to do the hair off sex the Welsh. I love Welsh. Love it. Love it. I feel that's very hard. Yeah. Welsh. It's so very hard. Oh, you, know, you know what I mean, sugar tears? Honestly, you could do it. You could do it. Tell Christina you could do loads of modelling. Oh, yeah. What's wrong? What's wrong? Yeah. Yeah. You need to see okay. I need a little fan. Yeah. You know, sometimes things are so noisy, you can't, can't hear, can you? Natalie, this is Big Brother. Tell Christina and Carissa that you've done loads of modelling. This is us, babes. Do you know, I've done quite a lot of modelling. You've done a lot of modelling? A lot of modelling. <laughs> but like, you know, like, plus, like, bigger models. Oh, I've done, you know, plus yeah. size. Natalie, this is Big Brother. Tell them that you did Playboy UK. And I did do a little tiny thing at Playboy UK as well. Really? Tiny thing, yeah. Is that what you're like, known for? What's that? Is that what you're known for? No, not really. No, I'm an, I'm an actress. Really? So I'm an actress, and I, like, I feel like a personality from England. But when I, I'm 28 now, when I was 10, when I was 10, I started in a soap opera over here. It's called ten. Extenders. Mm. What's the fame? What's your fame? You know, like your famous soap opera. Mm -hmm. You know, like Dan Evans. I've never watched any soap opera. I've seen those pictures of Natalie in the Playboy UK. Oh, hey, Jot. What will our twelfth and final housemate make of his or her new companions? Find out when we return. <laughs>